Broken Games HD is now sponsored by Blue Microphones. Whether you're an experienced content creator or just starting out, Blue Microphones has affordable and quality audio equipment to optimize your setup. Visit bluemic.com. All right, what's going on, people? So about to do this one verse one with the Omega Loser. Um, he said he wanted to do one Slayer and one SWAT. Um, this is my first game. I'm not trying to make excuses, but I this is my first game of the day i went just went straight into a one verse one with him i probably should have uh you know warmed up a little bit and i know i'm gonna regret not warming up because yeah this is actually a game i fully admit you have i feel like you have to warm up for it you can't just like jump into a game and like I at least i can't jump into a game and just be on fire right but after I warm up for a few rounds, then, I, then I'm just good. I'm good. Uh, we could do 30 probably, or 25 is good. Battle, I think he said he wanted battle map. Uh, I think we can turn these off. Rep weapon pads, we can turn those off. Um, grenades are fine, I guess. Power ups are off. Um, weapon pads weapon pads are for special weapons right place weapons are different so I'm gonna leave that on and he said he wanted uh, the battle map okay he's talking about crossfire 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 Okay, so Slayers, Crossfire, first 25, <clears throat> yeah, so Omega seems to be pretty good, I mean, I know he's definitely not a kid's move, so he might, you know, you might really give me a challenge, I might, I might hold that L, I might hold that L, definitely might have to hold that L. I really should have honestly played played at least one match because I always have that like awkward feeling because Halo doesn't play like any other game, right? Especially with the aiming. The aiming is just the aiming it isn't like any other game. So you have to re like acclimate yourself every time. At least I do. Every time I play it, get a few rounds in, then I'm hot. Or when I first get on it for the day, I'm thinking too much. I'm not acting, I'm just thinking. Uh, I don't know why he wanted this map. I mean, I like this map for breakout. Got him. I like it for break uh, for breakout, obviously, but I don't know if I would like it for one over. So I mean, I guess it's actually it's actually a good one versus one map because it doesn't have all the extra bull crap that uh, other maps usually have. My aim was off. That was ugly. He's hurt. 
Should I should have I should have put pressure on him. No choice but to jump out the other side right there. The thing people don't realize about me is, like, let me uh, let me stop playing. Like, even though a lot of these dudes have a deeper, like, Halo experience than than me. Even though a lot of them have a deeper Halo experience than me, you got to understand. Like, I'm an all natural gamer. And I come from a SOCOM era. Like, I come from the from the era. Like, a lot of people, I know I sound like an old man when I say, oh, back in my day, you know, how gaming used to be. You know, but you got to understand, sometimes, sometimes that takes precedence over experience, over, like, individual game experience. Sometimes when you're just a natural at things, and you just have a certain gaming background you just have a certain gaming background it, it kind of like just prepares you for for that like especially in one-on-one -on -one situations you know I had I come from that background of, of SOCOM one-on-ones uh, you know clan wars eliminations where there was no respawn so when I play games like these this, this is light compared to you know this is light compared to you know the experience experiences i had playing you know more tactical and strategic and intense games like that where you know you were put in situations where it was like you versus like a whole team you know because it's so calm there was no response so it would be you versus like the whole team in some cases just real tight situations where you had to be really clutch and be really smart uh, you know, your aim had to be on point at all times. You, you net, cause you never knew. Oh, that was sloppy. <clears throat> you know, you. It just took a, a high level of play. That's why I always brag about my SOCOM experience. I always brag about my SOCOM. Wow, I didn't, didn't killed this nigga so many times. Ran out of ammo. That's why I always brag about my SOCOM experience because it means a lot. It's funny, I was like, I was in a custom match with a couple of YouTubers, um, and one of the dudes was bringing up like how in like 10 situations, I'm just, I'm just always calm and always just, uh, you know, collective. I don't get really hype or nothing like that, especially in certain situations. Like a lot could be going on in the game and I'm just, and I'm just calm, you know, just as, I, as I'm talking to y'all and doing this one verse one, I'm just regular and calm. And that came from me, that came from my background of playing a game like SOCOM, like eight, like eight years where you had to be calm, especially in these, like. You had, you just had to be calm, right? I'm not going to lie to y'all. There were some of y'all may not know what I'm talking about. If you never like been in clan wars or done any like game battles or anything for, uh, you know, for a, 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 in a game or anything, or had a team or had a clan or whatever. But there were times when, like, when I just started out 
and when I just started doing game battles and clan wars and stuff like that, there were times where, when yo, this is real. Like this, this is like it. I used to get nervous at clan wars. Not gonna lie to y'all. Like I used to get nervous when I used to do clan wars and play against these other teams because you were going up against guys that were really good. I mean, I was really good, right? And that's why I was able to get in like really high ranked clans and SOCOM. But you, you know, especially when you're new and you haven't been in a lot of clan wars and I was young obviously I was still a young gamer um, you, you start to you, you start to get a little bit nervous okay you got his first kill you start to get a little nervous your hands start to shake a little bit like oh yeah you know and your nerves can sometimes overshadow your skill and there was times I would get nervous and like it would, it would cause me to not play so well but after years of playing SOCOM bruh it's like it's like little phases you. It's very little that phases you. And, you know, that's why I brag a lot. Because I believe, like, honestly, I believe I can be good at all, at pretty much any game, honestly, if that I, that I want to be. Some games I just don't tolerate. Really? Some games I just don't tolerate, like the... Like the ones that are clearly unbalanced, it's just like, bro, I don't got nothing to prove on this game. Reversal. There's nothing I have I have to prove on this game, right? Like Destiny, some people you know troll me about Destiny how I couldn't just Destiny's unbalanced crap, you know. Coming from a coming from playing something like SOCOM, which actually took skill, you can't tell me nothing about. I ain't trying to hear nothing about no Destiny, bro. Like, that game's... I ain't trying to hear nothing about that. But, yeah, I just heard me, uh, you know, ramble about ramble about this, uh, this old man talk about, uh, SOCOM. Difference between this match and Kit's move is uh Wow. <laughs> I was like I was waiting for that grenade to kill him. No he's gonna run into it. Yeah, the difference between this is we're actually playing this the right way, you know, with battle rifles and uh well with pretty much rifles in general or because automatics, the thing about Halo, Halo is a game where automatics are not the better weapon. Usually in, in most first person shooters or any shooters, assault rifles are, are, what, are what are dominant. And, you know, single, single fire weapons or semi-auto weapons are kind of like, you know, they have their difficulty. You know, they're compensated by maybe better damage or higher firepower or whatever. But, did he just stick me? Sure, I check them. But nah, Halo in this game, these things definitely dominate. It's all about it's all about these rifles. That's why it was that's why it was weird that Kit's move. He's he has way more hate. Yo, know, it's bad that I beat Kit's move. It's really bad because he's like he claims himself to be a Halo dude. Like I like Halo, but I've never been like. I can say a Halo guy. I've, I've just always been a fan, and I would play it with my with my boys and my friends and everything like that. But the fact that he's like a pronounced Halo player and the best bot and a huge Xbox fan, and he claim he doesn't use battle rifles because he doesn't because he doesn't uh yeah uh because he doesn't he claims he doesn't like it he doesn't know how to use it. Is what he's also said. I don't know how you don't know how to use it. I mean, it's a gun you just shoot. I think some people have a little trouble aiming. Uh, I think some people have a little trouble aiming it because 
you know, it's not your typical first person shooter, as I said. But it's strange to say that you are you you're not a you don't like the battle rifles that's that's like saying you don't like shotguns in gears of war it just doesn't make sense like what you it just doesn't make sense and this is a two out of three by the way we're gonna play swat next i've never played swat um i haven't played swat yet i believe swat is just uh he only headshots count and i'm fine with that because in he even though in halo like they say you shouldn't aim for the head until you take the armor off because it doesn't do any extra damage. I know it's been like that in the previous Halos. I'm assuming it's like I'm assuming it's like that in this one too. Um, <clears throat> but I just go for the aim for the head anyway, even when they have armor on, because then when their armor is down, you're already aiming for the head. So it's like, okay, well. were taking a huge bounce. That was real cute. I'm about to like run up on him. Did he really think he was gonna make it in that door? And we're about to be point game. I thought I'm not gonna lie to you. I thought I thought Omega was good. I mean, I thought he's. I thought Omega was better than this. Like I'm not trying to I'm not trying to dump on him, but uh, yo, I'm not. I'm, I lie to you not. I'm not trying right now. I thought he was like legit good though. I came in here expecting like to it to be like very tight. Oh, aim! Where where am I aiming at? That was sloppy. <clears throat> and next kill wins. Uh, what is a seven? This one's a seventeen. And he's highly predictable with his movements. <laughs> That's real cute. <laughs> uh, I'm just trying to get my health back. I'm trying to shimmy him. Reversal. Game over. He should have definitely had me right there. I think he lost worse than kids move, uh, so yeah. And I, I'm not here saying like I'm a beast in this, right? I just think I feel I just feel like I haven't come across the right skilled person to play against me. I'm sure there's somebody that'll make me look like a noob. Maybe not a noob, but I'm sure they'll. There's someone that can definitely show show me that you know I'm not as good as I'm looking right now. I'm sure there is. Like in this community, I'm not talking about like Halo pros, you know, that playing MLG. I'm sure they whoop me. I'm, I'm I'm sure of it. You know, they're pros. You know, if I played this game like that too, I would probably be a boss. Um, but I'm talking about in this community. I'm hoping there's somebody that could like definitely, uh, you know, put me down. Uh, score to win. It's, this is the same thing as Slayers, just like headshots only count, right? I believe that's what it is. Wait. Is that... Hold on, let me check something. Oh, shoot. Crap. Uh, it's alright, he's still in my party, I just gotta go back. Whew.
shield percentage okay it's that now when I put it on SWAT it the shield percentage goes to zero so I'm assuming that's just a part of SWAT um, turn teams off put that where's the timer Battle rifle, uh, no, it's battle rifle and Maggie. Damn, I've been talking through this whole thing. That means I gotta upload the whole thing. Usually, I like in Kids Moves one, I just I just chopped it up. Now I gotta definitely upload this whole thing, or it's not gonna make sense what I'm saying. Ain't gonna make sense. It's gonna be all choppy. They're gonna be like, what? I enjoy the science of games, you know, just learning, you know, little tidbits that improve you as a player. Because being a better player in games is usually all about knowledge. It's all about the subtle things you do that you learn makes you a better player. So I, I think in this mode, nothing but headshots do any damage. Like even if I shoot them in the body like a thousand times. Oh no, they do do damage. What? Okay, so what's the difference between SWAT? I don't know. I don't know. Strike. Oh, I think headshots do. Oh snap! I'm guessing. Okay, the only difference is there's no shield, so headshots kill you immediately versus the body shots kill you with more shots. Damn, he spawned fast. I'm guessing that's the only difference. And like I said, I practice aiming for the head all the time anyway, so it seems pretty natural to me. Yeah, like, I just... Like, literally, since this game came out, I've... Because I completely forgot, like, people say you should aim for the aim for the body until the shield goes down, so I, I just aim for the head anyway. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Double. Nice. I mean, I'm pretty much just standing out here. Okay, cool. Oh, damn. I like the quick respawn, though. I put down my controller for a second. I, I keep forgetting it spawns fast. Okay. He might be... He might have... He might definitely put up a challenge against me in this mode gotta be more careful versus that headshot and halo hitboxes are freaking huge so getting headshots in this game are like way easier than landing them in any other game and it's a lot of estimation like right like right there, I just had to like estimate exactly where his head would be when he came, you know. Reversal. Like right there. That was just like, just turned my controller. Nice little estimation. Sometimes you overlap it. Like that was clearly an overlap. But my height was proper. Like, Reversal. you know, you want to keep your, your height precise. I'm talking to y'all like I'm a pro at this. I'm really not. I'm just... Ugh, he made me do a 360. I just know the basics of gaming, man. That's all it is. I know the basics of gaming. Yeah, I, think, I, don't, I don't even think he's trying anymore. <laughs> I 
I was looking at a text message. Oh, wow. Nice. Never know where dudes will spawn. I don't know if I should render. I don't know if I should render this in 1080p or 720p. Advanced warf. Why do people be inviting me to games they know I don't play or don't have? Like. I don't understand that. Was that an accident? I hope that was an accident. The thing about it is the farther they, they are away, the harder it is to land that accurate shot on them. Halfway to victory. Double. Cause you gotta slow down your aim more. Damn, and I got a concussion afterwards. Pop. Ooh, these juicy headshots. I could zoom. I could zoom in and get. I could zoom in and get that. But uh, let me stop playing with my food. I'm wilding right now. Yep. That's why you see. That's why you don't play with your food, kids. I might hold this L. Watch him come back. He's getting serious. This is why you don't play with your food. When your prey is down, put them down. Never play with your food. Number one rule. Of various gaming. Various gaming genres. Do not play with your food. End it. Finish your plate. Always. Wasn't he over here? Nice. Always finish your plate. playing around after I just told myself don't play around 
I deserve to hold an L. He need five more, I need one more. Reversal. Game over. His movements Victory. are very predictable. And uh yeah. I win. Good game, Omega. Good game, y'all. Thanks for watching. <clears throat> I'm out of here, peace. Gonna bring y'all more of these.